What's up, Gucci gang? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new to the channel, my name is Kelly Jean. What's happening? This is Lucky Lou. And that's Baby Roski. <laughs> it is Saturday morning, and we are heading to the airport. Tell them why. Because I'm going to be in Arizona today. We got an event tonight in Arizona, in Tucson, Arizona. So, uh, yeah, we'll be there later this afternoon. Well, I'll be there later this afternoon. And uh, I will bring y'all with us. And Kelly Jean wanted to start the vlog. She was like, make sure you upload. We've been real busy running around. We really, I, Actually, I've been sick last week. That's why I haven't been uploading that. Kelly was sick the week before that. So we've been out of there. But we're back to normal now. Yeah, you guys, it was pretty rough. The sickness started with Houston and myself, and then it just trickled down with the whole entire family. The only one that did not get sick was Kingston. Glory to God for that because it was really rough. Um, it wasn't COVID, but you got no blood. Next weekend, Kelly Jean has her speaking engagement uh, on the March. Speaking engagement? Yeah. It's a revival, honey. That's a speaking engagement. You ain't gonna rap. You gonna speak. So yeah, you guys, I got my first booking. Shout out to his house, uh, church in Waco. They are like family to me. But they're having the revival. It's a three or four day revival. I can't really think off the top of my head. But you know, Holy Spirit led them to book me and I was just so in shock. But you know, God has a way of opening doors when you least expect it, right? So So next weekend we will ah, all be there. In the Waco, Texas, you guys bring in revival, shifting Waco, Texas. That's right. Spreading the word like wildfire. Yesterday was Coach's birthday. Happy birthday, Coach. We threw him a little birthday celebration at our house. With Baked a whole a bunch cake. of with a whole bunch of our Get Rap family um, members. From church. And it was really good. It was exciting and good and you know, simple but very supportive and loving. I'm gonna miss you too, babe. Yeah. Yeah. Don't cry, baby. I'm not. I don't cry. I'm a big girl. Let me just tell you that. <laughs> but I just miss him because, although he gets on my nerves, I don't get on your nerves. <laughs> he's just like he keeps me on my toes, and you know, it's just yeah, it's different when you're gone. Just dropped my bag off. So quick, so fast. If y'all don't got clear, and you go to the airport a lot, man, get clear. You bypass the whole line. Like VIP at the airport. Just landed in AZ. You see them cactuses, you know you're in AZ, man. That's how we pull up in the AZ. That's how we pull it up in the AZ. You know we had to pull up now, baby. Hey. Two hey. We are here in Tucson, AZ. My boy Mike Servin just picked me up. We're headed to the hotel right now. We're about to go give him Jesus at the just event. Just course, you know what it is? We're going to be at the prison on Monday, ministering and giving the brothers some encouragement over there in the prison facility in, uh, I think, Phoenix, Arizona. Come on, somebody. Just course, we're about to give him God, man. Let him know that true freedom comes from within, from, from God. Just course. Come on, somebody. Doing 10, come on, somebody better come on. Whether they're doing 10 years or 20 years or life, they can still get freedom through just course. Amen. Yeah. Asking for a better way, told me how to make it out. I wanna do the right thing, but I can't put this powder down. My drug dealer don't you speak know what down. It is. Me in them streets now, different girls in and out my bed, man. I can't see no way out. Jesus, 
fight. Can you hear me? In the city is trying to kill me. All my friends is on the street and rest of them in penitentiary. Uh, mama praying for a son. Shine your light on me, Lord. I'm ready. Here I come. What's up, baby? Take a picture of me, look. Look. Come on. Yeah. Right there. Come on, look. Come on, man. Come on, So, so we, we, we got studio time. Uh, we're going there. We're going there and knock it out. We're gonna. You got all of us together too. We gonna run these crooks. Like it's just cause you're gonna be a soldier, fam. Uh, honestly, like, not not really struggling with with anything in particular, but it's just the enemy just constantly coming against my home, constantly yeah. coming against my finances. It's constantly coming against my marriage. And, and truthfully, like, um, I haven't even paid my rent for February because the enemy has attacked my finances that bad. But I trust God. I trust him 100%. You know what I'm saying? Because if, if he, he pulled me out of the depths of hell, strung out for 17 years, 10 and a half years in the prison system, to anoint me to speak the way that he does, I know he got me. Sometimes, it, sometimes it's just like, man, God, where are you? But it doesn't, doesn't, doesn't stop me. Right here with you. You mean? You your wife out tomorrow, though. Right. So today's my wife's birthday, and tomorrow's a one year wedding anniversary. Yeah. Yeah. Well, no, you cannot arrest right? So, what you worried about? This is the war, though. This is what happened. Yeah. Yeah. Whether yeah. you're serving God or whether you're not, you're going to go through this, right? Yeah. yeah. Don't you? It feels good to go with, go through it with him, though, right? Yeah. Uh, in the end, there's, 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 there's promises of peace, and that's what you should have no matter what. You should have peace. If you don't have peace, find that peace in him. Okay? Father, I thank you, Lord. I thank you for Ruben's life, Lord. I thank you for blessing him, Father, for giving him favor, wisdom, knowledge, grace, and helping him, Lord. I thank you for breaking chains, Father, that the enemy has attained him with, Father. Not just him, Father, but his marriage, Father, his kids, Father, his finances, Father, everything, Father. We come against it right now. Satan, we tell you that you're a liar, that you have no place over my canal movement. And so I just thank you that you're going to break chains, Father, from this day forward, Lord. And just like my canal Brian said, Father, this this is going to be a, 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 a rough fight. Because the devil ain't just going to sit back and laugh and say and clap his hands and say, good for you, you're doing good, or you're a soldier for the king of the most high. And so, Father, we come against all that right now, Lord. And, and I just thank you, God, that there's still true soldiers, Father, that are standing, Father, in the face of the enemy and making his kingdom shake, even if he doesn't like it, Lord. That there's still soldiers here that eat, breathe, live, and, and, and will die, Father, for this word, for your gospel, God. And so I thank you for this soldier right here, Lord. I thank you for Reuben's life. I thank you for anointing him, Father, for giving him a fresh anointing, Lord. Yep. A fresh cup of anointing, yep. Lord. And for filling back that cup up and letting it run over, Lord. Because to my, many people, they might look at it like waste, but you call it overflow. You call it blessing, Father. You call it anointing, Lord. And so I just thank you, God, that you're going to touch my canal Reuben this day and from here on out, God. And if thing comes against him, Father, let him know, Father, it's because he's a soldier, Father, and he has an anointing on his life that the devil wants to break and crack and crumble. But the foundation that we stand on does not crack or crumble. Because we stand on a foundation that cannot be shaken, Lord. And so I just thank you, Father, that this soldier is going to rise up, Lord. And that he's going to know who he is in you 100%. Him on, and his family, God. Hallelujah. That he's going to take everything back from the enemy's camp that he stole from him, Lord. And I thank you, God, that he stands on your foundation. And I thank you that when his feet hit the ground, Father, every day, Lord, when his feet hit the ground, that you hear a soldier's armor shake and clank, Father. The armor shake and clank, Lord. From a true soldier getting up off the bed every day that the devil knows that this means war. And so I just thank you for my canal right now, Lord. I thank you for blessing them, Lord. I thank you for giving them that favor, Lord. For opening doors, Father, that no devil, no demon, no man can shut, Lord. As he puts you forth first, Lord. And as he puts you forth, Lord. The right way. The correct way, Lord. And the humble way, Lord. And I just thank you, Father, for touching his life, Lord, this day. And for flowing through him, Father, to this day, Lord. 
and letting him see who he is for opening his spiritual eyes and his spiritual ears father so he can see what you wanted to see and so he can hear what you wanted to hear father true soldiers have their eyes and ears open and so i just thank you for my canal right now lord and i just i i I'm, i just i just plead the blood over him i plead your blood over him god the devil can't pass that bloodline no more he has royal blood flowing through his veins and so I just thank you for it, Father, in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Shout out to the legal day, bro. Hey, I'll tell you what. It's because when, when, when we called you, I had to do my homework before. I had to make sure that, that Lucky, because I know you from Lucky Lucky. Yeah. So I was like, I got to make sure I got to do my due diligence. Yeah. So I, I had to start doing homework, and I had to start watching, like, like hours of, of your stuff. <laughs> and then I was, like, intrigued. And then it kept popping <laughs> Then you up. became a fan. Like, hey, hey. Then, yeah, then I, he I, got I, him, man, hooked bro, him. I was, I was watching how. That's um, what happened. Just course, you know what it is. I started watching all kinds of your wife be crazy. You gotta be like, she be cooking stuff, and I'm like, that sounds like good. Yeah, you gotta be a lot of crab stuff, a lot of seafood. But anyway, nah, man. I I, I saw your heart, bro. Yeah. And, and real recognized, real, bro. And I, I was like, now I was like, I know you just got saved, so I was really like, he's probably in that, you know, because I, I I know Christians that have been saved for like one month, and some that have been ten years. And um, anyway. I was like, he's probably in that couple year, you know, where he's at, which is okay. God. But when I when I started watching, I was like, man, you accelerated. Yeah. And I think a lot of that's your discipleship. But anyway, I was like, man, let's get him out here, bro. But my, my whole goal to get you out here was, I was trying to get the, the unbelievers out here. And I was like, man, maybe they don't know what to say. They're going to come out and we're going to get them. And then we're going to get them. Anyway, hey, what's up? I just said he had to do his research on it, make sure I was for real, huh? Make sure I wasn't faking like turkey bacon, huh, man? And what happened, man? It was a real deal, holy field, hey! you know what I'm saying? This is a transformation straight from heaven up above. Yeah! I'ma just say it like this, if God could turn me around, he could turn y'all around too, man. Hey! 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 Cut the other mic down. Bottles in the club, 
I ain't fully surrendered, I ain't blocking no more blessings. First time I turned down the money, he showed up with no question. I can't feature on no song, but he ain't no gift to my father. This is a gift that he gave to me, and I'ma use it for his honor. Shout out to Brother Hyman for bringing us out here. Oh God, oh God, hey, we're gonna do this Tucson revival for all generations. This this year was a super hit, man. We had 1,600 people that at, at that, and we, I didn't even think that big, but I just knew not to put a limit on God. Wow. And so this got to be yearly, man. I think it's, we got sponsors. We got so much stuff that was all God just leading the way. And so uh, I think it's mandatory next year. We're gonna book all, everybody, same venue, same same thing. And hopefully we lock it in and, and uh, come on somebody. On some Luciano TV. Look at this big cactus in his front yard though. <laughs> Man, no grass, straight rocks. Man, that's like in the cartoon. <laughs> hey, my wife. Hey, <laughs> debut. <laughs> What's your wife's name? Uh Lori Casares. And V and God bless too? Lori. Oh, no, I know Vivi's quiet right there. She's she's coming out for a little bit. We got Johnny about to hop in the Benzo, take us to Phoenix. Boys, Nephew, you ready? You ready? Baby Phoenix, man. Luciano TV. Yo. And we out. Come on, somebody, somebody, come on. Come on, somebody, 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 Come on, somebody, somebody, come on, somebody in the cave, somebody in the list, somebody came back. Almost. Almost, you almost got it. Come on, somebody in the cave, somebody in the list, somebody in the wind, but better come back. Yeah. Come on, somebody, somebody in the cave, somebody in the wind, somebody better come back, somebody better come back. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Where we at? Where we at? Tell me where we at. What is Salt Mine Studio Oasis? We out here in Mesa, Arizona, man. Mesa, Come on, somebody, somebody, come on. Come on, somebody, somebody, come on. Check it out. Kingdom Fellowship, man. I hear Salt My Studio in Phoenix, Arizona, man. Just knocked out four tracks. No, three tracks in, in what, four hours? Four hours uh, got the Mike Servant tracks, man. Six four, hey. Knocked out two. Then they want for the for the Lucky Lou single coming out with this with the whole fan band. Hey, we love you guys. Y'all a little uh recap of what's going on. Y'all stay tuned, man. Nothing but Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. You hear me? Mm. What's up, YouTube? Lucha Gang. I just landed. My beautiful wife just picked me up. Shout out to Kelly Jean for holding down the fort while I was gone. 
<laughs> Yo, I'm chasing his back. <laughs> oh my god, he was rushing me. I I was like a little late, you know. But how do I get out? Do I go this way? But anyways, he was texting me talking about uh, I'm outside. Where are you? <laughs> Yeah, so thank y'all for watching. What's up, guys? Keep catching up. This is Brother Rhino. I think you're too big to keep that music radio. We finna drop another hot track for you right here. Featuring Brother Lucky, Nephew Brandon, Brian, and Antoine Hill. We just want y'all to get the real feel of what this Jesus music is supposed to sound like. You hear me? It's all about Jesus Christ around here. Speak to me nice or don't speak to me twice. Yeah.